When working with large amounts of data, sometimes you want to find particular cells having a certain content you're looking for. At other times, you actually might want to replace that content. Both of these features are available from the Home tab on the extreme right button in the editing group, Find and Select, the binoculars icon. A simple example here, we're looking for somebody named Rick. If you'd like a search to occur faster, isolate the area that you're searching. We're not looking in columns B or C or anywhere else, just column A. Then click the Find and Select button, choose Find, and we're looking for Rick here. And by the way, it doesn't have to be capitalized. It's not case sensitive. We'll just type Rick. And we can find all of them in the same dialog box. We'll have to make it wider. And we might be a little bit surprised here. It found Rick in places we didn't exactly think of, like in Patrick or in Strickland. And of course, R-I-C-K is in all these locations. With a short enough list, maybe we found the person we were looking for or we found the records. Now, for those of you who are familiar with the filtering capability, that might be a better way to do this. But if you're in relative hurry and you simply want to see if something exists, the find feature is certainly capable. Recognize that there are some options here, too. And from time to time, it is important to match case. We didn't need that here. And sometimes you're checking to match entire cell contents. We wouldn't have wanted that here because we would have found nobody since no cell here contains Rick and nothing else. Now, just as likely a feature, and perhaps more useful in some cases, is the idea of replacing data. And a couple of simple examples here. In this company, they've decided to rename the status halftime into part-time, because some of the part-time workers are not truly halftime. So we'd like to change all the halftime entries here to be part-time. So we've selected column D, click the Find and Select button, Replace. So we want to replace what? Half with part. Now we do want that to be capitalized. So in this case, we do in a match case. So probably what we should do here is also make the half here be uppercase so that we make sure that we capture all those properly. And also in this case, we do not want to match entire cell contents, just a portion of it. So we want to make sure that box is unchecked. We want to replace all occurrences of half with the word part. 96 occurrences of that. And you see the changes taking place, for example, in cell D3 in the background. We can leave the dialog box open if we're going to be doing some additional searches. And imagine another one, uh, for example, in column B, Taft Building has been renamed the Harding Building. So we'll change all the Tafts to Harding. And once again, with a replace all. 63 replacements. This is a feature designed to work with text. It's simple, pretty straightforward. Recognize also a couple keystroke shortcuts. Find is Control-F. And replace is Control-H.